What's going on everybody? In this video, I'm going to be doing a front end facelift on my Cadillac CTS. I am Steven Wimberly and this is Working with Wimberly. So we're going to get started by removing the front bumper cover. It's actually not held on by that many bolts. It wasn't that difficult. And the next step, we're going to remove the headlights. Once again, with the bumper cover off, it's pretty easy to get these out. And then we move on to installing the new headlights. I have the headlights installed and I did test them and everything works. Over here we have the front bumper. I filled in the holes from the front license plate. Everything is pretty smooth. I had to start with 220, then 500, and I went down to 1200. So I think this is ready to paint. And these grills are coming out. I have a different set of grills that are going in. And also, these covers are coming out. I have the chrome trim with the fog lights that I need to install. The new chrome fog light will be here. This part is open, and I actually have the ducting that goes through the fender well to do the front brake cooling. And I have the bumper cover over here. It's all prepped took everything out of it the grill the bottom valence everything is off and it's ready to be painted and this is the color match paint that i ordered online and i'm just really hoping this is a good match got a couple coats on the bumper and i have to say thankfully this color match is absolutely amazing Right now I'm getting the bumper ready. I have the lower grill installed, have the chrome trim with the fog light installed. And here's the blank that was in there. When we come around to the back, you can see that the mounting locations for the fog lights are here, even if your car didn't come with them. So that's good news. I just had to add a screw on the left and right. This is good to go. I'm about to put the front bumper on. It's all prepped and ready to go. But I need to put these ducts in that go here to cool the front brakes. You see, that's the plug that was in here. So even if your car didn't come with this, um, if you can find something like this online from the junkyard, you can add it in. So that's what I'm about to do now. Here's the finished product. Swapped out the upper grill, the lower grill. It's got a new emblem in it. We have the new headlights, and we also have the fog lights wired in. And the way I decided to do it is instead of running the switch, I have it wired to whenever the headlights are on, the fog lights will just automatically turn on. So they're using the same wiring. And we also have our functional brake cooling ducts. So one there, it's one here. And you can see back there, that little round part that sticks out, that's where the vent enters the wheel well to cool the brakes. And you can see it on this side too. So that's the facelift.
If you found that video helpful, be sure to subscribe to the channel, give it a thumbs up, and leave a comment. God bless you all.